Hello everybody, my name is Topreva, welcome back to the Hearthstone beta, playing Arena's Malfurion Stormrage. We're now 6 for 2, so we have already evened up with my previous record, which was actually the previous deck. I mean, really, I mean, what? I, I almost get the feeling I'm getting better at this, but I don't think I am getting better at all. Just had some luck with uh, the cards we got on our first turn, I suppose, so... Um, I didn't look at the name of the last guy, so I don't know if this is better. We do get an extra card. Uh, I'm gonna toss these... I don't know, I'm gonna keep the Druid of the Claw. Let's see, Wild Growth? Uh, no, ooh. Ooh. Uh, I would love to get Wild Growth right now, so that, that would mean the tempo start. Uh, no Wild Growth, uh, so let's just... Coin into Fairy Dragon. Because Fairy Dragon is awesome and almighty and powerful. It cannot be killed by spells or hero powers, so. Fiery War Axe, yeah, you can now kill that, obviously. It does take 3 damage in the process. Uh, okay, I will armor up and hit you for 1. That's only 2 mana cost, that's actually very efficient. Indeed it is. Yay, armor versus armor. But I can do damage as well. Drink with me, friend. Drink with me, friend. Okay. Oh, I'm not going to attack. To be expected. Yeah, he can kill almost everything I have. Using either the War Axe or the, now the Brewmaster. Um, this is annoying. It really is. I'll just lay my... Yeah, I, I don't really have a choice. He will kill it without question this turn. But... Oh, he is going to take two damage, though. Get rid of his weapon. Playing the Gnomish Inventor. But that was actually not the worst one. Yeah, now the problem, Dark Iron Dwarf. Uh, uh, oh, actually, Yeti. I'll play the Yeti. If he doesn't kill it, it gets plus two attack, or we get it. Well, next turn is a taunt, regardless. So, ah, try this. ah, two two weapon. Really? You're that's that's okay. That's a waste of an execute. Seriously, that's a waste of an execute. Well, you can say whatever you want. This is really going to be a very fast game. Root of the claw with taunts. And kills everything that he throws at it. These two will kill it, but that leaves him two units down, obviously. But using himself and taking four damage to take out a Yeti, that's... Dared. Yeah, this is going to be a fast game at this rate. Oh, look, charge Divine Shield available next turn. hey yo. Yeah, what now, sir? How are you going to get rid of this taunt? I don't know. Good question, right? Using these two. Oh, he armors up. Oh, so he is going to use himself. Interesting. Do you have another execute? Are you kidding me? Yes, he does. Wow. Another execute. So I'm actually now I'm behind in damage, obviously. Hmm. Uh huh. So what are we going to do about this? Well. Killing something would be the best choice, obviously, so let's do that. And something that has three damage to use does mean the best choice, so I'll use it on this thing. He will lose something again if he attacks that. So this all depends on what he uses. I, I need a taunt it right now, though, that's a point. I need a new taunt. He can do 7 damage to me, as your drakes come out to play. Shields up. Gives that taunt, okay. Oh, he's just rushing me down. If I don't get taunt... Oh, God. Huh. I need a taunt to get rid of everything now. Yeah, so this is, this is going to be a very quick loss at this rate. Um... 
that thing is good. I can innervate for 6 mana total. And yeah, I'm dead. I mean, seriously, I cannot kill everything I need to kill right now. Mm -hmm. Victory These need to kill each other. It's now a 2 cost. Um... Yeah, I'm dead regardless of what happens. Hey, look, I can do one more damage, though. Ah, well played, indeed. Well played. Just attack me and get it over with. Well played. Indeed. Yeah, rush down at, at the best level. I needed a taunt to get it to win. So, this deck's ending at 6-3. Mm, more gold. So that's the end of this deck, and let's continue into the next one. Yeah, opening up some prizes. Druid of the Claw in Golden Form. Well, for a Druid deck, that's nice. More gold, that actually brings me to two more arena games. Hey, that's nice. Okay, we'll open the pack quickly before getting into the next arena game. Uh, yeah, I know. Oh, oh, my priest deck. Oh, and a golden conceal. Oh, my priest will like that. Take control of an enemy minion that has two or less attack. So, say, uh, hmm, say, where is it? Where are my neutral cards? Oh, these are the neutral cards. Say, a four mana cost card that's called the, where is it? Mogushan Warden. I mean, perfect card. Oh, right click. All these guys ever do is talk about the Thunder King. Boring. <laughs> yeah, that's a good card for the Cabal Shadow Priest to take over. Anyway, Arena. Let's play another one. And it's time for me to choose which to play again. Uh, Garrosh, Valera, or Anduin. Well, um, I'll play Garrosh because I haven't played it yet in Arena. So, we're gonna go with Warrior. We start off with a blue one. Um, yeah, out of these cards, Defender of Argus, seriously. Okay, 4 2, stealth, nice. 2 1, 4 1. Yeah, I need some early cards for uh, Light Run when character is healed. Not really expected in a Warrior deck. Uh, destroy a random enemy minion with 2 or less attack. Not bad for a Kodo, but Master Swordsmith. Uh, ooh, Vengeful Mercenary, or, yeah, I'll take the Vengeful Mercenary. Arcanite Reaper, ho! Oh! Another Mercenary? Oh, this, this might be weird. Cleave, deal two damage to two enemy, and a random enemy minions. That's not bad. Cruel Taskmaster, deal one damage to a minion, give it plus two attack. If you get an Enrage card, so good. Mortal Strike, deal 4 damage. If your hero is 12 for less health, deal 6 damage instead. But the Emperor Cobra. Oh uh, no, I'll take Mortal Strike. Um, a taunt. Not, yeah, it's not the best taunt, but it's a taunt. Uh, another Swordsmith. Or Arcane Golem. No, no Arcane Golem. Swordsmith. Um, yeah, two he. Uh, now we're Light Warden. No, I'm gonna take Priestess of a Loon. Because that healing uh, it's, might be useful in the Warrior deck. Gorehound, not a big fan. Huge fan of the Shattered Sun Cleric, though. Ah, Fiery War X versus Corcoran Elite. Um, I'll take the Elite. 5-5 uh, five, five with Stealth. Yes, please. Shield Block. Oh, I love that. Um, give a main charge. Fun with, say, Evangelical Mercenary, for sure, but Shield Block. Card draw and extra armor. Very good. 5-5, five, five, freeze a character, 3-6, taunt. I'll take the taunt in this case. I I really... Oh, I really want the War Song Commander. Oh, epic. Ugh. Mm, Murlocs. Cost one less for each minion on the battlefield, cost one less for each damage. Well, we're a warrior, we're about to take damage, so we'll take the Molten Giant. Should I? Should I? I mean, seriously? A third Venture Co Mercenary? It's, it sounds really fun to have. I will do it. 
Battle Rage. Well, we'll take a second Corcoran Elite. Um, plus one, plus one for each minion. Well, I think we'll need some lower cost again. Another Arcanite Reaper, but whenever a minion dies. I do have a lot of minions, so... Execute. We do really need at least one Execute in the deck. Oh yes, Faceless Manipulator. Um, equip a weapon, or another for... Another very high cost card, though. Um, I'll take the Armor Smith in this case. Uh, ooh, tough choice. I'll take the Fiery War Axe. Abusive Sergeant, give a friendly minion plus two attack this turn, or two six as well. We already have so many five cost cards, and that's actually not the worst one to combine with. So we'll take the. Or should we take one of these? Well, Wind Fury Harpy is strong, but is again a very much. Uh, it's a magnet for things. Okay. One damage to a minion for each army you have, or Gore Howl. Well, I'll take Gore Howl. There we go. We have a few weapons. Uh, we have a 2 cost, a 5 cost, a 7 cost, and one... Where is it? Weaponsmith. That's cool. We only have one Warsong Commander. But we have three freaking Ventrico Mercenaries. How much fun will this be? Because seriously, time is money, friend. Let's see. What are we playing against? It's going to be a Rogue. Versus... Immortal the Rogue. Oh, we start off with the Ventricle Mercenary. And... I don't like either of these. All very high costs. And... Oh, we do get an early Warsome Commander. Uh, it's, it's not a bad... It's... Well, it's not a worse hand, but it's still a bad hand. Oh, of course, let's give us Gorehowl too! Yes. Yeah. Ready for action. Oh my, it's Footman. Master Swordsmith, well, it's not going to be helpful yet, so we'll armor up instead. Just let's hold out as long as possible against a rogue. So, I mean, I don't want to play Orson Commander without something don't else on the field. Oh god. <sighs> yeah, something we do like is AoE, but... Give a minion plus one plus one. Uh, I could play stuff, but still. It's a 3-3 three, three, though, so he would need two creatures to kill it. We'd also need two to kill this, but something lives and then I will lose it. I will armor up again. Take one damage at most from these guys. Or some commander at a time where you have some bigger creatures to play as well. Yeah, I will now take two damage in total away from the armor. There we go. That's the best in this situation. Ooh, shield block. Five armor and not actually the worst idea right now. I think playing the shield block is going to be the best. Because, ah, we get a taunt for next turn. Perfect. And we have five armor again, and there's exactly five damage on the board, so... That just gives you new weapon, nothing else. So there's nothing in her hand to play at this point. Uh, beating up on armor, that's so cool to see. But now, now is when it really starts to get funny. With a big taunt. Yes, you have two mana left. Fiery War Axe, also nice. But first we taunt up. And we are holding out, so for uh, charge plays. For huge ass charge plays. Oh, it's sap. Well, it still means you just used your sap, and I can. Uh, I'll take five damage. And that's the end of your turn. Well, you play a new dagger, obviously, but... Let's see. We have six if we need... Ooh, charge. This is becoming more interesting, but let's play the taunt again. At least it's not like the freezing trap that makes it more expensive to play again. So... You do oh, backstab. Now what? Ah, eviscerate! Now it's gone. 
very cheap way of getting rid of that, that's true. Hmm. But we can deal a lot of damage in one go. Charge, plus one, plus one, probably what we're going to use. And then there's still this thing, so... Probably have to play the Fiery War Axe. Oh, perfect! Ha! <laughs> what? Oh, you kept everything alive, but still, that's, that was funny. It was the best situation, but at least it didn't damage me, stupid bomber. Um, faceless Manipulator, not what I want right now. But what we're going to play is... Um, yeah, we're going to play the Fiery War Axe. That gives me, leaves me with 5 mana. I will use that to kill this. And now we start pushing out units. Here we go. With 4 3, and you need something to kill that, obviously. Oh, look, it's a charge. Well, that's okay. Getting low on health, huh, mate. Please give me a magma golem right now that I can use to charge. Which I don't. Anyway, now we need to play a lot of creatures at once. So three leaves me with five. So give your your other minions have charge. That's okay. I will need that. I need we you to give that, that, plus one, plus one. I will Bring also need this. Which means I can use Push you to forward. kill this thing. I will use you to kill the boar. I will use myself to kill this. And this is now a 4-4. Four four. Depending on what you play, <laughs> it can happen. Also, this now deals 6 damage as well. So, what are you going to use this with? Gore Howl. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, Faceless Minip and Mortal Strike if it's a 6 health creature. That would be fun. Let's see. Can you kill? Yeah, I'm I'm very low in health though. That's very scary. But yeah, your magic shall not save you. That sucks. It seriously does suck. That's a little bit annoying. Well, at least Direwolf Alpha can get rid of that thing now. Okay, Dagger Mastery. Nothing. Yeah, I need a taunt. Eh, why not? So, let's see... Mm. If adjacent minions plus one attack, so this kills that. And now that it's silenced, it's had its use reduced immensely. Now we have seven mana left. I want... Yeah, Mortal Strike on the Mad Bomber is a bit of a waste. So I will actually armor up and play the tiger. Now I have 9 health to be killed. Yeah, uh, stupid stupid charger. Oh, it's already off, off the list to the left. Uh, that's silence. Okay, that's fine. So, how much damage can we do at once? Sea giant! Thank you! I love a sea giant! And the giving something taunt will be perfectly fine. I do need to use something to kill off uh, most of his damage now, though. Mortal Strike, yes, I can kill the Sea Giant after I manipulated it. Oh, deal two random damage. Um, well, I will first manipulate. Um, this is much more efficient. But I need to kill more of his stuff. Um, this would actually have a very high chance of killing two creatures right now. That's actually much. But then again, this still needs to die, so... Perfect, perfect. 
Now I'll use my tiger to kill this. I will use my roof to kill this. And armor up. Now, next turn, give us a 9-9 taunt. Yes, that's happening. So thank you for the sea giant, by the way. Now, how can you kill me? You need spells to kill me. You might have lots of spells, obviously, so but... Many options. Yes, you have many options. I would love to pull the magma giant now. Have two 9-9 taunts on the field. What? That would be ridiculous. Then there are assassinates and such. It's me for two. It's me for one more. Four damage you need. Uh, can you do four damage to me? Doesn't appear to be the case. Okay. Oh! Dang! Dang, yeah. That's a shame. Just didn't have the early game aggression I needed. Just too many high cost cards at the start. And that le left me with nothing. I do have a lot of... I do have enough low cost cards, I mean. I just didn't get them. Ah. Oh well. And seriously, uh, one more turn and I would have been quite safe actually but yeah that's eviscerate combo oh. synergy strike eviscerate it's that would deal seven damage at once to your opponent in that case so that is the strong combo for a rogue but still uh, malfurion gorfi hmm. uh, okay fire war axe is nice uh, we didn't. We have three Vanjico mercenaries and didn't get any of them. Oh god, that's so weird. Anyway, uh, ooh, molten giant. Not what I would like to see, but still, it's something. Okay, we. Hey, hey hello there. Um, I will coin and fiery war X and end my turn. I would rather use it to kill creatures than use it on Melfurion. Combined with armor up, it gives a very strong chance of killing stuff he plays in the beginning. And then we get other cards that are very, very strong to play. So, yeah, and also I, if I take damage, then there's also the Molten Giant that becomes cheaper and cheaper and cheaper. So I don't mind that at all. Now, this is a little bit more annoying, but... Uh, yeah. This is only one damage I would take out. Then again, armoring up and killing it doesn't give him the advantage. Creature gone. This is now 18, so please do more damage. I don't mind being low just because of Molten Giants. Jungle Panther, 4-2 with stealth. Okay, I don't mind. I really don't. So let's play the Shattered Sun Cleric. Or should we armor up? I'm going to armor up. I would like to use this to buff something rather than to just have a 3-3 on the field. Next turn we have a charge. That's good. We'll use it most likely on him because this will be in view if he attacks. Give a minion tall then plus 2 plus 2. Well then you just charge this down instead because it's suddenly visible oh he's shapeshifting and this becomes cheaper and cheaper just saying oh our, our healing okay so let's there we go and you have your cards gone and still yeah it's it is scary that He's he's going to stay at full health for a long time, but Where shall I Ah four six no Interesting choice very interesting Oh leper gnome and a charge I would like that Yeah and the reason I'm not attacking his druid is because right now I would like to just make this thing cheaper 
So please attack me instead, then I will uh, use my axe and my lepernome on you instead. And have 4 mana left. Also below 12 health gives it 6 damage, okay. Uh, this is becoming cheaper and cheaper. Hmm. Also I can give something plus 1 plus 1. Also very nice. Oh, interesting. My shield for Argus. Ah, taunts up. Very good. I will still... Yeah, I will take a lot of damage now, though, killing that. One damage and give it plus two attack. I have six health, six mana. So I will... If I take out the Kobold first, I will play a Molten Giant for one. I like that a lot. Hello, a one-cost Molten Giant. Um, taking this out is, I think, the most useful idea yet. So if I play this we thing... Must cleanse the sun well. Give it some damage this turn. Hello. Now we'll just kill his thing here. Now you try and beat me, sucker! <laughs> now I have stuff on the field. Please naturalize this. So this is quite funky. I suddenly gained board One control shot. again. Okay. Interesting. Drink with me, friend. Oh, what? Seriously? Is that what you're gonna play now? Ah, oh, graphic bug. So annoying. One shot. Hey, look, it's back. It's still going to die, so... Uh, maybe there are spells in hand. Claw, okay, deals three damage. Interesting choice. Mortal Strike, six damage. Hey, look, Vengeco Mercenaries. Um, this is dead. Uh, this is dead. Push forward. Just make sure it's gone. Then I should. Uh, yeah, choices. That's the first mercenary out. Now I can deal shit tons of damage. I I can kill him next turn if he doesn't kill me. I can. You 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 gotta be kidding me. And here is another waiting in the wings. Can you do 8 damage in one turn? That's the question. Mm, oh, that's 5. It's no mana though, so... Yes, then you are dead, sir. I'm, I'm winning with... Jesus Christ. So... Winning with two health left. Well played. Well played. That's one way of using a warrior's low health charge tactic. Oh right, warrior quest has been completed. Yeah, I did one game uh, paladin and constructed because I was like, let's try and get something. But paladin has so much guard choice; it's just ridiculous. But anyway. Now we're 1-1 one, one with our warrior deck, uh, yeah, so that's going to be interesting. Lots of fun cards, I mean, <laughs> Gorhal, three Venture Co-Mercenaries, like, what? But yeah, with uh, co this card is so good, and if you can combine it with big cards, then just painful. Anyway, I want to thank you all for watching, I will see you guys later.